Hey guys, Ravi here from IraFX and I welcome you to another After Effects tutorial. So let us first have a look at what we are gonna be creating today. So this is text transformation reveal animation and it's a beginner's tutorial considering the fact that you know the interface of Adobe After Effects. Also in case if you'd like to download this project file, you can download it absolutely free from my website irafx.net. Also do check my Patreon account wherein you can get access to amazing visual effects and downloads. So without any delay, let's get started. Let us first divide this tutorial into two steps. Step 1 making the background and step 2 making the text animation. So let us first create a new composition. Let me name this to text transformation and I set this to 1080p resolution and around 5 seconds duration and click OK. So in the first step, let us create a background by creating a new solid. I name this to background and I set this to fault comp size and white. It's good. Okay. So from the FX and presets panel, if you don't find this FX and presets panel, make sure that FX and presets is checked in the window menu. The FX and presets panel um type in gradient ramp we have this gradient ramp effect and drag this onto our background so i usually use a default setting of this uh, gradient ramp effect so uh, i set this to 960 540 end of ramp to 960 and 3000 and i simply turn this to radial ramp and swap the colors since I need a dark background, I set this to a dark red color that we have a clear texture of our background. So let us head away into step number two wherein we animate our text. So now click on this T button here so that you create a new text uh, since we are using a transformation. Um, kind of animation. Let me uh, type in Optimus and change this. Let me center this and change this color to uh, a dark blue. And right click this text layer and pre compose it. Uh, name this text one and make sure you click on this button so that. All the attributes are moved to the new composition and click OK. So from the effects and presets panel, the effect that we're going to use is card wipe. So drag this card wipe effect onto our text one. So at the first frame, make sure at the first frame of the composition and set this transition completion to zero. Click on this. Um, timer icon here so that uh, a keyframe is created and move to around two and a half seconds or um, seconds forward and set this value 100 so you see that this kind of animation is appearing here all right um, change this rows to 20 and the columns to 50 so the next thing that we have to do is create another uh, text. Um, let me type in prime and change this color to um, this and we just put it over here. And pre-compose this layer as well name it to text 2 
and move all attributes into the new composition and click OK. So drag this text one onto the top and change this back layer to text 2 and hide this text 2 by clicking this I button here and now if I move forward this Optimus turns into prime like this. Now in order to have a transformation kind of effect to our text layers select this text layer and set this timing randomness to 0 0.6 and now if you see it you can see that there's a little transformation kind of animation but we can set it to a better way by changing this position jitter and set the Z amount to 0 at the beginning click on this timer button here at uh, first frame of a composition move to around uh, 1 second forward and set this jitter amount to 15 and go to again 2 uh, seconds forward at our end position and set this jitter value 0 back again and now will have a cool transformation kind of animation like the way you see in the video looks good to me and the next thing that we have to do is add a better um, transformation effect by duplicating this layer so duplicate this text layer the text 1 by holding command D on your keyboard or control D and now you have this duplicated I set this bottom layer I'll rename it to effect and I add fill effect onto it so I type in fill from the effects and presets panel and drag it onto my effects layer and I change this to yellow and also the effects and presets panel I type in glow and add this glow effect to the effects layer as well so um, I also do one particular thing to the effects um, layer where I change the timing randomness to 0 0.8 okay so I want this effect only to be applied when this transformation is happening so Expand this FX layer, expand the transform and set a keyframe for opacity at this point. Set this to 0, move a little forward, set this to 100, move again a little forward when the animation is done. Click this, this uh, diamond button so that a keyframe is again created a little forward and set the opacity back to zero again so now you see that when transformation is happening notice them then it's gone in order to have the yellow effect applied in a better way change this glow radius a bit like this to around 50 50 yep, look good to me and if I start playing it, this is how our text transform into other text. Yep, this is how the text transformation is done using a card wipe effect. So, uh, as told you earlier, you can download this project file and you can use it right away from my website irafx.net. And uh, if you'd like to talk to me, you can uh, connect with me on Instagram at VFXGuyRavi. Um, if you're looking for more visual effects, consider subscribing to my channel. And see you guys next time with another tutorial.